so many people are actually frustrated searching for jobs and they don't know how to get started with the issue of job i've had a lot of people reaching out to me hey mike i want to get started with a job i've applied for several interviews i've not been called i've applied for several opportunities i've not been called the focus of today's video is sharing with you one side that helped me when i started my journey in the cloud industry if you go into this side you can get yourself started and you can be sure that you will be able to gain the necessary skills once you go to this site and get yourself some free gigs you'll be able to start matching the skills which you've put on your resume on the site by the end of this video i'll share with you that site and you sign up on the site and you get yourself started you set up your profile to the end start applying for easy going gigs that match the experience which you have if it's your first time coming across our content hit the subscribe button if you're a returning subscriber thank you so much for watching our videos thank you for supporting us and thank you for letting me know how relevant these videos are to you and i hope that as i continue producing this content i'm able to answer some of your questions and if i'm not answer all the questions which you have you can book a one-on-one -on -one mentorship call with me with the links that are in the description and you can equally join our devops community the side which i'll be sharing with you is called upwork when i started my journey with cloud computing i was always depressed how do i get this job where do i start from who is going to recruit me so i had to go on upwork and i had to set up a freelancer account on upwork i was able to clearly pitch my portfolio on upwork that could help me land some jobs some people have even gotten jobs and they're not able to keep the jobs but once you go on upwork you see a vast majority of gigs that people have issues that they're trying to solve and need experts to solve those issues for them so once you have an upwork account and you have set up your profiles on upwork you can start taking some of those gigs that will help you position yourself rightly for your real job which we are maybe hoping for once i went on upwork i was able to set up my account and after setting up my account i was able to land my first role as a site reliability engineer my role as a site reliability engineer gave me the opportunity to implement some of the skills which i was able to gain while i was learning as a cloud computing enthusiast so why am i doing this video for you is because i just want you to take a few minutes of your time go on upwork set up the profile set up your account and start applying for jobs you don't necessarily need to get a job maybe from indeed or from linkedin you can use a site like upwork to get yourself some gigs that will keep you busy solving problems giving yourself more opportunities to train with the technologies which you've learned so once you come on upwork which is this site upwork is very basic and it's available everywhere around the globe this is what the site looks like you can sign up for free there are job opportunities not just for cloud computing experts but there is a vast majority of of other job opportunities there are several jobs in different different areas you have jobs on development and it jobs on design and creative sales and marketing writing and translation legal engineering finance and accounting admin and customer support so that's a vast majority and if you even see just it on its own there are over a thousand eight hundred and fifty three skills which it experts have to get jobs as far as the platform is concerned you can use this platform for example to find work that maybe matches your skill that matches the way you learn that finds a way to promote you so for example let's say you want to find a job that matches your skill it might be aws it might be terraform it might be jenkins it might be kubernetes whatever the case you want to first select those skills and you want to check jobs that match the skill set which you have so once you come to a site once you come here you already see a list of different jobs that people can occupy now since we are talking about devops i'm just going to use the keyword devops there's no need for on-site visitation or there's no need for you to go to a company premise to get these jobs done so once you type devops for example you're going to see a lot of jobs that match them devops you can type jobs that match the term cloud engineer site reliability engineer solutions architect and so on in the freelance job that i found we have lk consultant we have need a devops engineer with spring boot we need a lead devops analyst we need a senior infrastructure engineer there are a vast majority of jobs for example if i was maybe going for the elk consultant they'll give you an opportunity to bargain the price and everything there is a job description after the job description you have the terms and conditions less than 30 minutes a week less than one month expert experience and it's a remote job so you want to visit upwork and set up your profile on upwork and again you want to watch a video on setting up your project repository and the projects on four aws hands-on which you can do to land your first job so once you've done some of those hands-on and you come on a platform like upwork you can easily set yourself ready for your first 
job i just thought i should share this very brief video with you and get you ready to get yourself rightly positioned if you have any question you want to leave that in the comment section so i can answer and reach out to you and if you have not yet subscribed to the channel hit the subscribe button right away and if you are a returning subscriber thank you for watching our content join our devops community with the links are in the description and why not participate in our events participate in our live sessions and be productive in all that you do thank you and see you in our next video